Modern warfare is clearly a brutal affair. Your military doctrine is starting to reflect some of this principle. In total war. Scorched Earth, damn. Catapult. It's now artillery. Nice. That went straight to artillery. Suddenly we're looking all militarized. And these inquisitors are just sort of standing around. That's okay. It's okay. How are we for tourism? How are we winning on tourism? Probably not. We are very much leading on the cultist thing though, but yeah. Greece is way ahead. I wonder who this unmet player is. Clearly not very a particular big player. Probably a minor dude on this continent stuck between like Congo and and America. Most likely. Who knows? Could be anyone. Maybe Norway. <laughs> Norway. Uh, imagine if you were Norwegian, though. That would suck. Ah, uh, JK, JK. They're my neighbors. We're allowed to make fun of our neighbors. That's how it works. Tanks? Dude, tanks. The tanks have to be cool, right? That's like a rule. Tanks have to be cool. Alright, barbarians have a battering ram sitting there. Alright. It's a little bit old school. Just gonna start moving all our dudes down to her. I think you should denounce her first, probably. I like, dislike you. Yes, you don't, don't seem very happy about that, but not a big fan. Not a big fan. I wish I could call this like a religious war or something, but I can't, I guess. I think she needs to have converted something of mine. And well, actually, how does that work? Let's look it up again. Cast a spell, I. Uh, spell I. Belly. Uh, War of Liberation? No, no, no. Reconquest. We could have been Reconquest or Holy War. Yeah, if one of you see this converted to the enemy's religion. That happened before. Um, remember, Protestantism took over a few cities earlier in the game. But once Holy Roman Romanism started, you know. What, what was that? Oh. Well, who knows now? Let's move. Let's move our units. Kind of losing the uh, amenity from sit staying inside a city now, but it's okay. It's important to get our troops on the move. There's a sound bug here again. I hope not. This scout can do nothing. It's gonna get destroyed. Okay, I think the sound bug is gone. Yeah, good, good. I just kept hearing the movement sound forever. Oh, this is going to be real good, guys. I thought all we needed was plastics for the oil. But this is combustion. Ah, maybe this is like a, you can get it from combustion for oil wells. Otherwise, you build it. Oh, hello! The residents of your breathtaking new neighborhood clamor for a plan to conserve all the world's natural treasures. Conservation. Rome 2. None of these cities were the one that wanted. It was Jerusalem that wanted one. London isn't half bad though, but we're kind of going to war with that one soon. I guess we'll just send it to Aquileia. Bit boring, but good. Slowly move towards where we want to go, friends. We're going there. One step at a time. I think that's it for now. We can obviously, of course, build more. Is London a coastal city? Not really. We might be able to reach him anyway, though. Although, to be honest, by the time we finish a battleship... That's only one tile away. Movement 
Ooh, this gives range to adjacent bombard units. That's pretty good. I'm gonna build an ironclad just to, like, sort of explore the ocean. This is gonna be such a slaughter, though. Damn. Damn. Can you still move? No, mommy, you can't. But... Neighborhood completed in Rome. Again, let's build a military academy before we build more stuff. Simplest here would probably be towards... I guess an encampment, maybe. Build one there. Maybe? No. no. Screw encampment. We don't need that right now. We could, we could go for other stuff instead. Which is an entertainment complex. I don't really think we need that either. <laughs> Let's just go for the broadcast center and build more culture thing. Similarly in Bristol. Bristol could use an encampment though, actually. That wouldn't be too bad. That's kind of near the front line. It's not a bad idea. Aha! The Legionnaire! This whole Legionnaire! I guess just kill these guys. Kill some barbarians. It's always good, you know. Should give you experience. Although maybe there's like a limit to how much... Yeah, one experience wasn't particularly much. But he can easily take these out, I'm pretty sure. So you want to... Maybe you want some war too, Barbara. It's been coming. It's been coming a long time, Frederick. You've you've been you've been at my been been a real real dick about things. Maybe Frankfurt should be mine. That's all I'm saying. Okay, yeah, this is probably going to be the end of my scout. No, the scout he he lived. All right. Okay, now not so much anymore. I'm sure they were actually. English scouts. The cars uh, haven't uh, advanced barbarians. that much since we were kids. When you boil it down, it's still a gas combustion engine. Tanks! Fast moving, modern era, heavy cavalry that ignores zone of control. Nice. Let's get our move on. Oh man, the terrain here. Taking a while for that to hit through here. See the sound? It keeps staying even if I move them. Never mind. Should be okay. Rome to. I don't know. I don't know. Let's just go Bristol, I suppose. Oh, you're gonna have to stay this turn. Form core? Alright! Yeah! Take him out! I didn't quite kill him. But you did well. Can we fill in, uh, make another core here? I assume we will be able to. Yeah, you better be shaken, Vicky, because bad things are coming your way. And escape with their quadrium fleet. I guess fleets are like the same as a core, but on the ocean or something. Untutored. No, you were right to worry. Hold on. Is, will that give me lots of things? Because we haven't had a Casus Belli. We're gonna just ignore anti-air gun and machine gun. Because we don't have we we can't have a Cassus Bella yet, even though we've denounced her. So we need to wait. I, it feels like you should pretty much always ignore that request, you know. Yeah, 
as the core. Slowly getting there. Can't quite <laughs> declare war yet. Alright. What is this thing? Oh, peace. Press love is peace with Hojo. Aretium wants us to build an encampment. We can build a whole bunch of things here, really. I guess an encampment is as good as anything. Just in case we're gonna go to war. No, I don't think we'll go to war, though. Why would why does, I just. I don't want an encampment. I'd rather just build, like, a ranger. Or something. A recon unit. Do some exploring. Village road. There's no need for that quite yet. Do your job, legionnaires! For the glory of Rome! <laughs> form core? Yeah, let's form core. Nice. I guess we move the artillery. Can you not move? There we go. Weird. That I got a little thing up here. How many turns? Five turns, right? We need to announce her for five turns before war. I feel like it's been more than five turns. Probably hasn't. Look how modern this song is now. Hey, we found a camp. Is there only one legionnaire left? Oh no, no, it's a scout. Oh my! Wow! Wow, dude. Real, real not cool. Alright, we're gonna avenge this real bad. Legionnaires is coming to solve this problem. Anti-air gun, machine gun, atomic air ranged unit. What is this? What is this? Oh, I can build a, core, a straight core. Interesting. That's kind of cool. Oh, the Eiffel Tower. All tiles gain plus two appeal. Damn. Okay, I'm gonna build that. Probably. That's probably good, right? That seems really good. But maybe, I mean, I'm in the middle of war now, so maybe wait a bit, but also, also kind of nice. That's a real good quarry, though, to replace. Damn it, that's the problem, you know, a lot of the time. I'm just gonna build myself a machine gun core instead. Can we declare war yet? Nope, not yet. And we don't want to have a surprise war. So we're just gonna leave our troops here. Be real, uh, <laughs> real scary. Our military is now trained in the way of combining three units into a single army. Much larger and more powerful than a core unit. Interesting. When they are preparing for war, those who rule by force speak most copiously about peace until they have completed the mobilization process. I guess that's me. <laughs> I'm all about peace until now. Uh, Leve en masse. That's really good. That's basically twice as good as the thing. So that's something. Defensive Pact and War of Territorial Expansion. That borders your empire. Must have two of your cities within ten tiles of two opponent cities. Uh, that's not enough, is it? Like, first of all, she's way too far away. Now. And also... Well, actually, I could probably go to war against Japan with that. Anyway, that, can we have both of these? That'd be pretty good. So that's three less per unit. The war wariness is also quite nice to have. This should get, how much gold will this give us now? Uh, 20 more. I guess that's kind of good. 
Oh man, we need to go back to upgrade. Okay, let's do that. Can these guys unite together? That's <laughs> fucking Spearman! Spearman, come on now. Tribal village. Which is the, is that the tribal village? I guess it is. Just need to go to work first, though. Alright, artillery. Um, go all the way down there. Can we bring our inquisitors with us into their thing once we actually make war with them? Hey, why not? We can try, right? Why not? Okay. Maybe next turn we can do war? I have a feeling I, I think turns take longer than they do. Or, uh, like, less as long as they do. So I think it's probably been ten and then it's only been like three. Because I have a lot to do every turn. Alright, mobilization is finished. Why did it not ask me to... Oh, no, it went straight into ideology. Eureka! Telecommunications. We're boosting a lot of things. That's pretty good. Plymouth can build. You, we can't build cores here, which is interesting. Maybe you need an encampment or something for that? That would make sense, actually. Let's try that. Fill a policy slot. Oh, yeah, no, that makes sense. Because that now replaces it, it got removed. It was just like a turn late. I guess we'll put in the less war wariness then, because we're gonna go to war soon. Infantry Corp, Star Star. No, watch the war! Oh, oh, oh my god! Yeah! Yeah! We're taking him out! Took like no damage. Upgrade. What can we do? He can upgrade here. Machine gun! And these Inquisitor. Let's get rid of there. Can we combine? Because we could combine, right? Yes, an army! Okay, I love this. This is immediately cool. This is sort of like a mix between Civ... Okay, so in Civ 4, you could have like your entire army on like one tile. And then you move that one tile army around. You just had like a, a stack of doom that just walked around and did everything. In Civ 5, it was all in one go. So you had like all, all, each unit took one tile. That made war very different. Now, it feels like at least late game, you learn how to combine things into proper armies like this, which is pretty cool. Can we declare war yet? Yes, we can! Ooh, colonial war! Yes, that's what I wanted to. All warmonger penalties halved. War? We are not amused. I didn't expect you would be, Vicky. <laughs> but it's time. Über Vorsichtigkeit sie gelobet. Zu helfen diesem Riech hieße tanzen mit dem Tode. Yeah, yeah, all right. What? Yeah, whatever. All right, it's time for warp. This is going to be ridiculously easy. Can we form a core? Yes, we can. Can the Inquisitors go inside yet? We'll find out. We have declared war. Rome has declared war on Victoria. Why doesn't it say Trajan has declared war on Victoria? Or Rome has declared war on England? Interesting. Anyway. Let's go. Let's go to war. Let's go. Let's do it. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. It's funny. I had a lot of dudes. Now they're basically down into one. But that's... So we're going to get to do less things per turn. But we're going to get p pretty strong about it. Um, which one first? I guess we take out this one. Legionaris is dealing with things. We did lose a dude. That's something. Took 17 damage. 
Alright, let's go check out the war. We're gonna take some hits now. No one is... No one likes me. They think you're a warmonger. Well, I mean, yes, sort of. I did declare war now for the first time. Not for the first time, I guess. I did declare war on Vicky before. That didn't seem to do too much damage. <laughs> yeah, bring your warriors to bear. Holy shit. Vicky, please, you're sending your units to die. We got a promotion available. That's a shame, because that means we'll have to spend a turn for moats. Production in Bristol. State? Yeah, sure, let's build a stable, I guess. One turn. Trade route, Rome to Plymouth. Trade route, Rome to Aratium. Indonesia orders. Minor defeat. Interesting. That's in the encampment, but we can take out the crossbowmen, though. Nice. Uh, the upgrade... Plus 10 strength. That's pretty good. But it's also good to be strength when defending. But pretty much all of these are gonna be land units. Oh, expert crew. Dude. That would be great. Let's just go that one now. We'll have to be defending a little bit again, but... Trading post in the city of Brussels. Okay. Let's get down here. How do we... I guess you stand there and then, then we attack? That indicates that we are in range, I suppose. This is such a slaughter! We got machine guns killing spearmen! Vicky, Vicky! This is not going as planned for you, is it? We can actually upgrade this dude to infantry as well. Oh, where's the Legion? Oh. He's, doing, he's doing his job out here. They're continuously making swordsmen. We can fight them for now. But soon we might have to go back and heal. Oh, the scout is here. That's that scout's probably gonna die. Ah, uh, no one likes me because I make war. Yeah, but come on, guys. This this series is heading towards its end. I I feel like I should do something fun. Honestly, like probably if I had been playing this solo, I probably would have been like, I'm just gonna be line for science and just finish the science. But to make it a little bit more fun for you guys, let's have some war. Because I wanted to do to see more of war, you know, find out. Oh, hey, here we go. Inquisitor is actually doing stuff. That's that's okay. I don't really care about the Inquisitor here. The good thing about computers is that they do what you tell them to do. The bad news is that they do what you tell them to do. Well, without a computer, I wouldn't be sitting here doing this. So I think they're pretty much a net net good. Research, combined arms for destroyer and aircraft carrier, plastics, that's for the offshore oil, uh, offshore oil rig, there we go, got it. Helicopter? God damn. We got some cool stuff. Nukes, everything. Mechanized infantry. Information era. Look how quickly, quick, like, four turns for future. We get, man, science is interesting in this one. I feel like we're getting every turn something new. I can just click future tech and we're just going to get everything. Super quick. Just a, a couple of turns for each. Feels like it doesn't... Because your own science output doesn't scale exponentially as it did in Civ 5, neither does the requirements. I'm just going to literally put it on future tech and just let it go and just, like, just... We'll get everything. Meanwhile, Bristol. Can we now build core? No, we can't. Interesting. Why can we only build cores in Rome? Hmm. It doesn't matter that much. Build, can we build a Cristiano Nintendo? We can. But it wasn't very good, was it right? We decided it wasn't that great. Tourism from relics and holy cities. 
doubles tourism output of Seaside. Yeah, we don't have... That's pretty garbage, then. I'd rather just build some more units. Like a tank! I mean, by the time he's done, the war will probably be over, but screw it, let's build a tank! Wait, no, let's not build it. Let's build it in Rome, because Rome has all the things. The armory and stuff, so, yeah. Damn it. Still only two movement tiles here. Alright, artillery guy. Total wall damage. A nice chunk. Holy shit, it ripped it apart. That's doing pretty good. One more. Can we still move? No, we can't move. Gonna have to... Wait, no, I did something with the Legion. I did not want the Legion to move there. Sorry. You need to attack. I mean, it's probably gonna die now, actually, the Legion. Take a little bit too many hits. Rip in peace. It's fine. We should have actually probably dropped that back and healed it instead. That's okay. That's okay. Didn't really care that much about it. To be honest, I'm gonna be quite brutal here. As for the Inquisitor, you're probably gonna lose here. Apostles seem noticeably stronger than Inquisitors. I kinda feel like Inquisitors aren't really that worth it. I mean, they're cheaper faith -wise. Holy shit, we have a lot of faith, by the way. Can we buy another thing with faith? We pro probably can. Ooh. Just amount of nav naval units. Oh. Gain 100%, 100 gold. That's when it retires. That's when the passive effect. Oh, we, we, we want one of those. There was a city-state quest for Great Admiral. Let's get one. Our civilization's attention to the naval arm of our military has given rise to a great admiral in our ranks. When deployed wisely among our ships, we are sure to have a distinct advantage in battle. Yes, except we're not really going to use one much. <laughs> An envoy. Uh, we'll probably have to send that one next time. Where did the admiral appear, actually? Here? There. Xing Shi. Next. Hello! You want coal, and you'll give me diamonds. And gold. That's not a bad deal. I mean, it might, might, maybe it's a bad deal, but to me it sounds like a good deal. I don't even know what diamonds do, but I hate diamonds, right? Coal does make it so that you can build the, the ironclads and stuff, but that's okay. We have those. Promotion available. It's taking so little damage. Actually taking London, we'll see how that one will go. But it's he's not being touched! I mean, he actually has lost a bit now, but we'll upgrade it and it'll be great, you know? We're gonna take out the encampment. Because we have the machine gunner here now as well. Enemy spy killed. Plymouth to Rome, probably. Yeah, it's always Rome. All roads lead to Rome. Build... Oh, we just filled a... Finished a... No, artillery completed. That's not true. We built a ranger. Let's just put it on automate. Here's the infantry corps. Okay, we had a lot of options here. You can pillage, pillage. Pillage road and pillage normal. Promote. Plunder trade route. And it's fortified to be. I think we promote. And we get. That's not that particularly good. But well, that also healed it, so it's just nice. Okay, machine gun. You can take out these guys. Jesus! They just all fall down. That's for the artillery. Let's blast a little bit here. Rip. In peace. It's got no health. We can now walk over there next turn. I don't know about you guys, what you think watching this, but as a player, I, f I feel like war is cooler in Civ 6. It feels better. I like the idea of combining units to make cores and armies and stuff. I think that's pretty cool. 